After we saw the influence of Resident Evil 1 on the new Resident Evil 7, it's a good time to see the brand new things that Capcom is trying out to push the game forward on the right path. Let's take a look at the top 7 new directions that we will find in Resident Evil 7. Number 7, First Person. The most obvious change in the new game is the shift to the first person perspective. Add it to truly immerse yourself into the survival horror situation, specifically with the VR on PS4. First person will give Resident Evil a new look. And when has changing things up ever worked in this series? Oh, Resident Evil 4? Don't worry trolls, it'll be okay. Shut up! Number 6, The Smartwatch. Once again, the key is immersion with the new smartwatch the main character will be wearing. This is more realistic than a menu or an on-screen HUD. While we don't know exactly all the functions this new age wristwatch will perform, we do know that it has an EKG monitor on it that will monitor the player's health just like in classic games. Just don't have Siri on when the bakers are lurking. Welcome to the family, son. Number 5 the tape recorder. Bye bye ink ribbons. The new safe system in RE7 will be done via audio tape recorder, which has a similar film noir type feel to it, but a shake up from the classic typewriter. It is still unknown whether or not we'll have to collect safe tapes across the plantation, but I do know I might try to pop in that Ace of Base mixtape my girlfriend made for me in sixth grade. Number 4, Shadow Puzzles. While classic puzzles will be making a return, one of the new types of puzzles we have seen in two different places is the Shadow Puzzle. This is where you take an item from your inventory and create a shadow to match a shape on the wall to open up a secret door. An interesting new style of puzzle that will probably drive you crazy after trying minute after minute. Just don't make obscene shadow puppets on the wall. This is a family show. Number three, telephone. As we've been shown multiple times, a mysterious woman will be calling us on a household landline. It's a cell phone with wires connected to a wall. We don't know exactly what she will do, but we think she may be giving us clues or mission objectives. We do know she will be telling some bad riddles. When is a door not a door? When it's a jar. What? Number two, interactive items. In the past, we've had to pick up the books, put them in our inventory, examine them, remove the key, then yada yada yada, I'm bored. Now, in RE7, you can skip the middleman and examine different parts of the environment in real time with a clean inventory to find hidden items or clues. You know, like you can do in real life. What's in the box? Number one, VHS notes. Who doesn't love reading long notes, files, and journal entries? Oh, everyone? In Resident Evil 7, you may not have to always read to find clues, as VHS tapes will sort of act as those files or notes, revealing things that happened in the past in live action with you controlling it. This is very interesting and an exciting change that should be a lot of fun, as it allows you to take control of different characters. These seven new directions are very interesting. So as you look back at the nostalgia that made past games great, keep an open mind for some new changes coming to the game that are here to shake up the series. Crimson Army, what other new things would you like to see appear in Resident Evil 7? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe.